welcome to the kickoff of Gotta Go Fast. My name is Octane Pro, and pretty much what this is, is this is a video blog of kind of my weekly progression of not only learning Smite a little bit more, but also on top of that of getting a little exercise. And so hence the title, Gotta Go Fast, kind of comes directly from Mercury and it comes some of his speed. Um, so pretty much what we're going to do is throughout the next several weeks and months, uh, several times a week, I'm going to go ahead and upload a, a video. And it's a quick like five minute video, nothing too crazy, just something quick and easy going over my experience that week with what I've been trying to focus on learning and smite, you know, what I've been keeping an eye on and then, you know, where my exercise has been uh, as all of us start to get like that little bit of a gamer gut going on. And I, I always see like, Hey, how can I make it fun? How can I go ahead and go, you know, how can I work out, but then also watch and learn smite at the same time. So let's go ahead and take a look at my setup for, uh, you know, what I'm going to do in order to take exercise and smite and merge them together. So let's take a look. All right, guys, so here is my setup for Gotta Go Fast. Um, what my plan is, and, and starting out tomorrow here, is we have my treadmill. It's a classical treadmill, so it kind of stays out of the way there. And uh, pretty much what we're going to do is, you know, we kind of have our, our treadmill set up, good to go, directly in front of our 60-inch television here. And I have up the Smite Team Dignitas Cup. And uh, this pretty much allows me to hang out run at the same time as watching Smite and kind of, you know, join the two together. That's kind of the big thing for me is, um, you know, when I run and when I am running or exercising, my mind is always like looking at the screen down below here or looking at how much farther I have to go or how long I've been going. And so my goal is, is to just have Smite up on the screen, keep my mind occupied so I don't have to even think about how long I've been running, how far I've been running, how fast I've been running, and I can focus more on learning about Smite by also exercising at the same time. So for me, uh, to this week, what I had the opportunity to do was watch the Dignitas versus SK Gaming in the Dignitas Conquest Cup. And, uh, you know, one of the big things for me was, as I said, you know, I'm looking to learn Smite more and more. And with that said, like, you know, I have a very great passion for casual games and the gods and stuff like that. But I could definitely improve on the competitive side. So, you know, learning the teams, learning the competitive scene a little bit more, learning the players, learning the gods of choice. So starting out with that, I decided to watch Dignitas versus SK from this past weekend. And one thing I wanted to focus on in that game was I'm very much a support player. I love playing Ymir. I love playing Sobek. Uh, I enjoy playing Geb and Athena, uh, but you know I always used to have a strong passion for Odin, and Odin was actually played in this game on SK Gaming, and uh, so I wanted to kind of keep an eye on Odin and see you know what Odin was going in this game, uh, in regards to what build he was going, the position he was going, the, the play style he was going. So I went ahead and followed along with Odin in this SK Gaming versus Nigdatas. All right, so after the game had gone ahead and finished up, and I was kind of looking at like. Okay, what build did I see the Odin go first and support level and stuff like that? Uh, you very much start out with like uh, Mark of the Vanguard, Boots, Sovereignty, Hide of Urchin, and then Magi's Blessing. And he was using Hog, which is not you know a no-brainer there, especially playing this like support level uh, god. And then he popped like Heavenly Agility. And usually I don't I don't go Heavenly Agility uh, as a support player, so I really like this pickup and just the play style that I saw him playing throughout the entire time. Very aggressive, uh, very much rotating lanes, very very often. And with having the heavily agility and then also with the leap uh, possibilities that he had on him as well, it made him very strong, very, very uh, chase heavy in this game. Uh, and I was really happy to see Odin making like a really good comback. Uh, as you guys know, like Odin uh, in the beginning of the competitive scene was very strong and then kind of fell off and then strong and fell off. So now we're seeing him make a very, you know, a good comeback here within the competitive scene where we get a chance to see him again. Um, so it was great. Uh, you know, I ended up going, it was nothing crazy. Like I ended up running uh, total, it was 30 minutes that I ran and I, and I ran for two miles. And for some of you fitness buffs out there, you might have been like, oh, well, that's nothing. You should be like doubling that, whatever. You have to remember, like, this is day one of working out again, of trying to get exercise, of trying to get back into shape. So for me, it was perfect. I ran 30 miles. I barely looked at the treadmill, barely looked at the timing. Um, uh, you know, I ran each mile in about 15 minutes, give or take there. And that uh, was perfect. So I plan to continue this up the rest of the week, continue, you know, what I can learn about Smite, and I'll check back in uh, via this video blog, guys, and uh, talk about it, you know, my progress, um, not only on distance on the treadmill and stuff like that, and eventually I want to incorporate uh, weights into the exercise as we get farther on into kind of 
getting a little bit more in shape. But then also update you guys on like what I've been focusing on and uh, learning from Smite, what I've been watching every morning. Because my plan is is to get up in the morning, give myself about a half hour to an hour worth of time before I go to work, which means I'm getting up at 5 a.m. or or 5:30 uh, in the morning before I go to work, and 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 just learning a little bit more about Smite, starting out my day right, and then also exercising. So thank you guys for checking out the first rendition here of Go Gotta Go Fast. And I will see you guys on the next video blog.